Oh, this place will be flooded with kids. I just need to tidy up a... Uh huh? D did I do this? No! No, 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 no! It's not your fault whatsoever! How are we supposed to clean all of this? What? I... I did all this. I destroyed everything. I... I know I was supposed to be a villain character, but I was never supposed to be a real villain. I... I... I'm a threat. I should be deactivated. Don't you dare! But... None of us are at fault. There was something outside of our power causing this. But now, we can make it better. But why would Fazbear Entertainment leave us for so long? Let it get so bad. Do you think they'll come for us soon? Hard to say. But if we don't clean up this mess, they may not come back for us at all. Or they think we're obsolete and not worth saving anymore. No, no, no. That would be such a loss. They don't like needless losses. We just need to look on the bright side of things for now. We clean the daycare, and once they notice, we wait for someone to come pick us up. Oh, I hope you're right. We can only hope. Don't worry. We'll make it through this. <laughs> Oh gosh. There we go. Put this there. Oh, look, this place is looking so much better! It is, isn't it? Son, I want to apologize for everything I've done to you to our home. Things I had said. Take your nap! No more sun! No more sun! No more light! Forever night! How much I hurt us. How much I hurt you. Keeping you locked and abandoned in our sleep. <clears throat> please, no more nap! Just please, take my hand! Let's just go home together! Be whole again! I could hear you beg and plead, but I could not act, no matter how hard I heard you cry. You don't have to forgive me. I won't blame you if you won't forgive me. I am a monster, and I don't deserve your <laughs> kiss. Uh, huh? <laughs> Moon, I just wanted you back, my silly mischievous partner. Now I have you back. That's all I could ever ask for. Of course I forgive you. Thank you, son. Oh, oh my goodness, please, we still have more to clean. Oh, who cares, five more minutes. Everything looks so much better now. Now we just need to wait for Fazbear Entertainment to come back and see. They'll be so happy. We should go check on the others. Maybe we can help tidy them up too. We haven't been outside in quite some time. I wonder if everyone else is okay. Yes, let us go check on the others. It looks so dark out there. If you'll permit me, I can bring us through the dark. Of course you may. We trust you still, Moon. Thank you. Hmm. Uh, everything is ruined. Don't you remember, Moon? Not exactly. Everything's a bit hazy. I just hope everyone else is okay. Huh? Oh gosh, what was that? Not sure. Oh no! Who's making a mess? Son, please! <laughs> hmm, the second floor. What could be rattling around over here? Hi, friend! Huh? Little girl, are you still over here? Ah, uh, come here, Fredbear. Aw, you're so soft, Bonnie. Looks like I get the exclusive life-size blush. Softest one around, too. Uh, oh my. Let's go play, too! Wait, what? You're faster, lad! Don't gotta tell me twice, ha ha ha! Ha ha, suckers! 
<laughs> Great job, Superstar! What did you wish for? I wish to be like you when I grow up, Foxy. You want to be like me, Cassie? Uh, Roxy? Are you okay? Oh, Cupcake! Where did you go? I wanted to think... You. Oh, good gravy! That is so unsanitary! Do we have any cleaning supplies left in the closet? Ah, uh, son, please. Oh, it's so good to see you boys again! <laughs> you too, Chica. Oh, before I get distracted, have you seen a sweet little girl around? Cassie, who's that? Yes, Cassie! She was one of Roxanne's girls. She actually helped get my voice box back about an hour or so ago. But my power cell's been acting up, and now this power at random. I wanted to thank her, but also ask what the absolute heck a little girl like her is doing here. Everything's a mess. And I can't see more than three feet ahead of me. Most of my memory is hazy and fuzzy. And so I... I'm really at a loss. But it's too dangerous for her if she's still wandering about. An hour, an hour ago? Cassie still being here means... She's been here for... Hours. We have to find her. And we will. We just need to figure out where to start. She could be anywhere inside the pizza plex. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Chica. Try to make your way to the daycare and we'll help you repair your power cell when we get back. <clears throat> oh, gosh. Everything is such a mess. I can't orient myself as well as I used to. Hmm. Any ideas where we might be? Well, there are a lot of arcade cabinets. Hmm. Do you realize how little that narrows it down? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't really know. Oh, this place must have been flooded with families. It must have been so full of life. I can't wait till Fazbear Entertainment has this place open and new once more. Then everyone can be so happy again. Yeah. That'll be the day. And it will be amazing with all of us together. I know we can. I can feel the others calling out to us. We can help. We will find them. Yes! Yes, you're right! We will find them! <laughs> uh, is this area collapsing? N no, I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Huh? What on earth was that? Is someone there? Please, I need help. DJ? DJ? Thank heavens, I thought I was all alone. Oh, my little Luna Moth, how wonderful it is to see your sweet face again. Oh, DJ, oh god, DJ. Where is my sweet little Comet son, hmm? He's here. We're all here, DJ. We're here for you. I thought everyone had forgotten about me. No, never. M may I see the sweet little ray of sunshine? Of course you may. Hello, D DJ, I, 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 I'm sorry. I can't see as good as Moon in the Dark. Oh, my sweet little Citrus. It's alright. It is still an absolute delight to see your bright and sunny features again. Oh, DJ. How are we supposed to get him out of here? I'm not sure, actually. Have you tried pulling those slabs off you? Oh, I've tried. But either I can't grip the slab well enough, or I worry if I somehow displace it, I'll end up crushing something even... More vital, or breaking myself into unmovable condition. I, uh, see. Not really, but I'm sure we'll think of something. <laughs> um, we can try to toss ideas of how to release DJ from the rubble. That could work. Whichever shall I do, I must be the luckiest arachnid around. A sweet cosmos all to myself. Oh my. Maybe we could use our tether. Son, you see those beams on the ceiling? Mm, no. Um, my goodness, son. Mm, sorry. So I was thinking if we use the tether, loop it around the beam for extra leverage, <laughs> we can safely remove mm. the slabs from DJ. I am... I'm not 
too sure the beam, let alone our tether, could support that weight anymore. It's all completely deteriorating and could snap, or worse, bring down more rubble onto DJ. Hmm, that is a valid concern. If we had enough force, we could still push them off him. We could go for the others while we still look for Cassie. I don't want to leave him alone up here, though. I don't want to leave him alone either. But I don't know what else we can do! Oh, I might have an idea. It's just a small idea. Why we go throughout the plex? Oh? <sighs> I think DJ's happy. <laughs> Definitely. Hello, little friend. I desperately apologize I cannot offer you any music at this time, but you, my little marshmallow peep, are deeply appreciated, you cute little fella. Come on, we should get moving before we're missed. Oh. I know, but once we find the others, it will be much safer. I know. I just hope the others are okay. After some confusing vent scurrying, come on. <clears throat> Of course, the one vent we can access to here is blocked. Come on, Moon! Suck it in! Suck what? We don't have anything to suck. Moon! Moon! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Just a bit winded. Um, uh, Moon? Yeah. D don't move! Mm. The water in front of us, it's electrified. What? Uh, oh my gosh! How, how did we not fall in that? Oh gosh. Is there a way we can get back from where we came? Moon? 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 Are you hurt? Let me check. <clears throat> nope. Hmm? Moon, what's that? <clears throat> help. Help me, Vernon. Please, burn it, please, please, help me! Oh, God. Moon! Monty, he's... Moon? We can't. Moon, can you hear me? So much pain, we have to... Please, Moon, focus! Oh, dear God. Grinding. Sun? Burning. Moon's not responding! Do something. Don't worry, uh, I'll take care of it. Anything. <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't... It's all right, Moon. You're okay. Shh, breathe. It's all right. Please, I'm sorry. It's all right. You're all right. <sighs> oh my. How can we get him out of there? Perhaps I could maybe find something to drag him out? But if there's nothing around, something not conductive, something sturdy. Uh, I know. <clears throat> Eclipse? What are you doing? You'll see. I just have to hurry. Uh, okay. We believe in you! Ugh. <sighs> it burns! <clears throat> you got him! Oh, thank goodness! Uh, let's pull him out. Hurry, Eclipse! Yes, I'm going. Hmm? Moon, what's that? Hmm? Help! Help me! Burn it! Please, burn it! Please, please! Help me! Oh, God. Moon! Monty, he's... Moon? We can't. Moon, can you hear me? So much pain, we have to... Please, Moon, focus! Oh, dear God. Grinding. Sun? Burning. Moon's not responding! Do something. Don't Sir, worry, I'll, I'll take care of anything. it. I'm sorry, I think... It's all right, Moon. You're okay. Shh, breathe. It's all right. Please... I'm sorry. It's all right. You're all right. <sighs> oh my. How can we get him out of there? Perhaps I could maybe find something to drag him out? But if there's nothing around, something not conductive, something sturdy. Uh, I know. <clears throat> Eclipse? What are you doing? You'll see. I just have to hurry. Uh, okay. We believe in you. Ugh. Ugh. Ugh, it burns! Ugh. You got him! Oh, thank goodness! Uh, let's pull him out. Hurry, Eclipse! Yes, I'm going. Man, he's heavy! Ugh. Easy, Monty. Please. Easy. <sighs> Easy. 
You're okay now. <laughs> Monty? Monty? <laughs> What's going on? I don't know! Let me out. I can get us. No! I'll go out. Hang on, on Eclipse! Kid. Huh? Kid, I don't know who you are, but you've got to get away from me. What? I'm dangerous. Monty? I can't control myself. All I see is red. Please, I'm sorry. Just save yourself, kid. I don't want to do this. No, we're not abandoning you. Eclipse! Hang on, Monty. We'll help you. Help with what? He tried to attack you. Monty's still in there. I saw him. You did? Just be careful, Eclipse. I... I don't understand. Monty's not supposed to be like this. I swear, if they've done to him what they had done to us... If they have, then we need to reboot him into safe mode. Uh, I feel dizzy. We need to get a Faz wrench. We need to get him back to the daycare, too. Also, how did Eclipse manage to... Uh, whoa, uh, hey Eclipse, are you okay? Y yeah that just came out of nowhere. Oh, gosh, I'm all right. I'm just, uh, just a little dizzy. I'm not exactly sure what I did, but... Nope, nope, no collapsing. Uh, I'll take over from here. Uh, yes, yes. Come here. Let's get you some rest. That's it. Easy. You did amazing, Eclipse. Thank you. Now, shh. Now, we just need to figure out a way to get Monty back to the daycare as safely as possible. Great. Oh, I guess this isn't so bad. Oh, wow. The boys really did clean up real well in here. Can hardly tell that there was a mess here. <laughs> this is nice. I forgot to do my stretches today! Okay, we just need to set him down and find a Faz wrench to reboot him. Yeah! As soon as we get to the workshop, I'll take care of the rest. Boys! You're back! How'd you do? Uh... Am I interrupting something here? Uh, 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 we can explain. Okay, listen. Monty was tampered with, so we need to reboot him in safe mode. Could we ask you to please watch over him. He's very dangerous right now, and we don't want to lose him. Oh, my gosh. Yes, I'll have you watch over him. Oh, don't be such a grumpy puppy, Monty. This isn't like you at all. Okay, we've made it to the workshop. It's all up to you, son. Don't worry. Also, I know you'll take good care of Eclipse. No, of course. All right. Now, let's see here. Mm, come here, Eclipse. Oh! Hi, friend! Did you need something? Oh! Hey! Where are you going? Alright! Alright, I'm coming! Don't worry. What do they want? No idea, but we'll see. What is it, little one? What do you want me to see in there? Oh my goodness! How did you get stuck in there, little one? Hi, friend! How long have you been stuck in there? And what do you even have that fast wrench for? It's about as big as you! To help a friend? I'm not sure I understand. Well, I was planning on taking it to help with one of my friends. Uh, oh! Uh, well, I don't have to keep it exactly, so... Maybe we can just... No, oh, you're in trouble. Yes, <laughs> Moon? Here, why don't you come with us? That way, once we're done with the Faz Wrench, you can bring us to that friend of yours you want to help. And I can help you use it. <laughs> there we go. That's the spirit. This is adorable. All right, let us get back to the daycare, little one. And you stay safe down here until Fazbear Entertainment cleans up properly down here. <sighs> Good morning, sleepyhead. Mm. Gosh, how long did I nap? What did I miss, Moon? Hey, Eclipse! Nothing much. We're just making our way back to the daycare to help Monty and Chica. Oh, come on, Monty. You always use 
used to love the Grampy Gator. This just isn't you at all. Sounds like Chica's trying every trick in her books to get to Monty. Luckily, thanks to Micro, we have the key. Cute nickname. Aw, thank you. It's fitting, isn't it? Chica! Boys, can you back? And we've got tools! Oh, good. Monty's not even cracking a smile over here. Oh, don't you worry. I'm sure he'll be back to his old self in just a moment. How so? We found a fast wrench! We can reboot him into safe mode. And once he's back online, whatever's blinking him will be kicked out. No, I hope you're right. Here, let me help you keep him still so you can work. <laughs> oh, thank you, Chica. Anytime, you cute little lemon drop. Thanks again for helping me power down Monty. Of course. At the very least, that should let him relax for a little bit while we untie these. Oh, look at how focused he is. Trying to protect Sun and Chica. <laughs> oh, I feel so safe and protected. Uh, what's he doing? Did Monty twitch? No! Oh, oh gosh, Sun! Micro is chewing on Monty for some reason! Please check on him! Micro? What's gotten into you? I. What is that animal he's chewing on, actually? I. I don't know! It looks. painful? Come here, little micro. I'll take you from here. Wait. Oh, I think I know what it is now. Oh gosh, some awful memories are coming back to me. Mm -hmm. I'll bet it's one of those bad upgrades it gave us. Me with my bad voice box. Sending things haywire. Then those must be from Monty's claw upgrades. But it looks something. Like barbed wire snares. That's gotta be painful. I would have been acting out too if I was in that much pain. We can't have that then. Tempered upgrades. I'll get rid of these stupid things myself. Please be careful, son. We don't want you or Monty to get hurt. Don't worry if anyone is perfectly detail oriented and meticulous enough for this, it's son. It gets annoying, but it's helpful. Yeah, you show this nasty spiky thingies who's Easy, Chica. Easy. <laughs> there you go. You should be feeling much better now. Yeah. Actually, that power cell feels so much better. Did you wake Monty yet? Not yet. I feel he would be much happier if we were both awake to greet him. Yeah? Oh, thank you so much, son. I don't think we told you enough when we were open. But you were absolutely amazing. Thank you for everything that you've done. I... B oh! She's right, you know. You are amazing, son. Oh, we need to do this more often. It feels so wonderful. Let's reboot Monty. Y yeah, yes. Let's. Uh, what the... Um... Easy, Monty. Nice and easy. <laughs> son? Hey, Monty. Son! <laughs> Son, 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 oh my god, I can just see your dumb, silly, <laughs> smiling face all. Oh my gosh, Monty, please, <laughs> slow down. What, where's Moon? Ah, he's probably crammed somewhere inside you. I'm a judge. See what Jesus is here too. I'm, Monty. I'm sorry, I thanked you. I couldn't control myself. I missed you so much, you dumb, smiley son of a gun. Come on, you little punk. I thought you were more flexible than this, Moon. Ah. I am now, Chica. Still can't understand you, Cupcake. Now listen to me agreeing with me. Hiya, boys. Chica. <laughs> Chica, Miss. Come on, Monty, try out those tears. We're all here. I'm working on it, Featherfoot. <laughs> I never thought I'd be able to lift you up, but <laughs> here we are. Heck yeah. You been working out? Don't you know it? Ah, <sighs> we're getting closer to helping everyone. I know. And it's wonderful. Now we just need to keep our end of a little deal. Yeah. Now, why don't you lead us to that friend you mentioned before? Yeah, yeah, we're coming. Down here? Alright, lead the way. Uh, Alright then. Oh wow, brave little fella. Uh, that's a lot of 
micro It's a whole family. micro family! Can we adopt that mode, please? I wonder what they're saying. Need to wait and see, I suppose. Oh, I wonder which little one we're going to help. They all look like they need help. <laughs> Can we please adopt them, please? We have so much room for them at the daycare! Oh my god, oh, son. No. Oh! Looks like he wants us to follow. Wait, then where's he going? Huh? Alright, son, you're up. There's some low light here. Oh boy! I hope it's enough for me to work with. <laughs> I'm coming, I'm coming! There you are! Uh. Oh. No. What? That's gonna be a tight fit. Excuse me! <laughs> what? Moon, please. <sighs> well, no time like the present, I suppose. You got this, son. You can make it. <clears throat> I'm almost, almost through. Come on, son, suck it in. I'm working on it. Got it. Sorry about that. I'm coming. I'm here. So where are we going, little bud? Cell had been violently ripped out. And he's somehow still active? This. This is unfortunately far beyond this reboot, Micro. He needs a multitude of repairs. Bonnie, I don't know if you can hear me, but I promise you. Uh, uh? Bonnie? Bonnie? Uh, are you. Wait, what? Is he somehow connected to the wet floor bots? He is. I'm not sure how, but he is. He must be able to see us through them. Oh, Bonnie! I'm so glad you're still with us! I'm so sorry it took so long for us to find you, but I'm so glad we have! Freddy will be so happy. Everyone will be so happy. No, oh, I'm feeling so many emotions right now. It's so wonderful. Bonnie, I can take your body back to the daycare. I'm not too sure how long it'll take before I can find all the appropriate parts, but I will help you! Oh, you're right, Moon! Oh, we should look for Freddy next! He'll be so happy Bonnie is alive and can be fixed! He'll be thrilled as I was to finally be reunited with you, oh dear partner. Yes! Yes, 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 yes! Let's hurry and get back! We still have so much to do! Certainly. Leave it to me. Yeah, almost. Got it. Got it. <laughs> Great. Now, let's get Bonnie back to the daycare. Back to the daycare we go. Would you like some more tea, Roxanne? Oh, yes. I would love more fast tea, Chica. You're the most pretty bird in the whole wide world. <sighs> Looks like everyone is still doing well down here. <sighs> yeah. Now we just need to find a comfy spot for Bonnie. <gasps> I think Izzy Moon's coming back! Oh, it looks like they brought another friend! Oh, heck yeah! Nate, I'll get more tea! Hey guys, you'll never believe who we found. And even better, he's still with us. Just needs repairs. Bonnie! Oh, Bonnie! I thought he was gone, but he's still active! Does that mean he can hear us? Wait, his eyes are glowing! Can he see us too? Goodness gracious, look at all these horrible damages. How are we even going to repair like that, Sonny? Bonnie's alive. He's still... Oh my god. Why do I feel so much pain in my chest? I can't... He stays and I, I feel like I've seen it before. Memories are fuzzy though. But my heart hurts. Why does it hurt so much? Poor Freddy practically buried him. But he, he was still alive somewhere begging for help. Why do I... I was attacking everything on side. My memory's hazy, huh? But I know I was. I must have. Oh God! I must have done that to Bob. I don't remember doing it, but there's no other explanation. I killed my best friend. I killed my best friend. Those injuries, so many injuries. He trusted me without him. I would have never been able, been even a part of this. And I can't. 
Phil, why'd they even save me? Why'd they even risk it if I hurt? Oh, God. Did I go after kids? Have I killed someone? I, I can't remember. I'm dangerous. I'm, I'm, buddy, would you even believe me? Don't you touch him! Uh, you did this to him! No, I wouldn't. Monty, you evil creature! Thank God, never. What's going on with Monty? Look at those injuries. It had to have been him! I know you did it! I don't know. He looks like he's seen a ghost, though. I, I didn't. I, I don't. Monty, Monty, easy. You haven't done anything, Monty. Son, he's... I don't know what to do. Monty must be taking Bonnie's current state really hard. I've... I've never seen him like this before. Uh, why don't you let me out? I'll try to talk to him. Only if you're sure. Yes, please. Monty, I can see that you're not alright, and that's okay. It's okay to not be alright, but please, look at me. Monty, whatever is plaguing your mind about Bonnie and you is something that cannot be changed. But it can be mended. He can hear you. And if what is causing you so much pain can be put into words, I'm sure you can tell him exactly how you feel. Talk to him. And when the time comes, you both can communicate whatever is going on. But right now, he needs you. So, to begin, why don't you be at his side? Okay, Monty? Bonnie needs me. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll talk to him. I'll be right with him. Hey, he needs me. Bonnie, Bonnie, I know you are in there. I, I don't know what's happened to you, and I don't remember if I had something to do with it. But if I have, I'm so sorry. But I'm here for you now. I'm here for you, Bonnie. I'm sorry, buddy. I think Monty needed that. Yeah, I think he'll be all right in a bit. Ah, uh, my goodness, Monty. Huh? Hold on. Who's this? That's my son. That's not me either, though. Oh! That means that we just need to find Freddy and Roxy! And not only can we help free DJ, we can have all hands on deck to help find Cassie! Technically, as long as we find either Freddy or Roxy, we should have enough muscle to help DJ. Uh, did you guys hear something? Come on, Eclipse! Let's hurry! We're so close to having everyone back together! Well, okay, I'm coming. Come on! Let's try to make our way either to Fathom Blast or Roxy Raceway! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Must you be so cruel, son? My goodness. These poor boys are going to run themselves ragged. But the heart's in the right place. I do wonder who that new little cutie is, though. I guess we'll meet them when they're ready. As for Bonnie and Monty. Oh, uh, hey, little guy. Sorry, am I making a private pawn of a gator tears? <laughs> Sorry, I'll, uh, I'll, oh, thanks for the blanket, little buddy. Money will be nice and comfy now. I'll dry up these tears. I'm glad they're both back. <laughs> it, Eclipse? It seems like something's on your mind. Huh? You are welcome to tell us. Uh, but you do not have to, of course. Uh, 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 I'm sorry. I did not mean to be so transparent. But I will be more than happy to tell you what's uh, on my mind. <laughs> Though, please forgive me if it sounds odd. There have been more odd things in this pizza place than any of us have ever dealt with. I think we'll be fine. No worries, Eclipse! Take your time! I've been feeling like someone's trying to get my attention. Like I'm hearing whispers, but I can't fully make them out. But it feels like they've been growing more and more afraid and desperate for help. At first I thought it might have been the others, but now I... I think this is someone else. Something else. Uh, but I still want to help them, but I fear the only way I might hear them clearly is if somehow I do what I had done when I saw Monty before. Wait, what? Eclipse, you passed out from overexertion after that incident. I... I know. We just don't want you to hurt yourself, Eclipse! I... I don't like it, but I won't stop you if you truly wish to do this. I'm just... Worried. We 
couldn't see what you were seeing. And if something were to go wrong, we, we wouldn't be able to help you. I'm wondering if that's where I was trapped in for so long. I don't want to imagine losing you in such a place as this. Don't say that. I, I promise I'll take the utmost of care, okay? I know you will. We trust you, Eclipse. Once we get back into an open area, you can take control to try and find that someone who's calling you. Uh, thank you. I'll do my very best. And if it comes too overwhelming, I'll come back to both of you, I promise. All right. I can feel an air for our tether here. We won't be able to call it here. Aww. All right. Don't worry. I can climb us up to a vent when we're ready to leave here. All right. Eclipse, you're up. Uh, thank you both. Again, I promise I'll be careful. Thank you. <sighs> so, uh, I'm a hazard, I guess. But I got knocked in half from a hurricane bucket again, didn't I? I'm not too sure, but by the looks of it, probably. Dang, kinda sucks. <gasps> I know what to do now. Oh, do ya? Well, yeah. I need a daycare. Uh, what you doing over there, Chicken Dougie? <laughs> You'll see. Right. <laughs> Legos! Oh my freaking god, Jacob! <laughs> That's so dumb and I love it. Mm, come on, Eclipse. You can do it. Come on. Uh huh? Oh gosh. Uh, hello? Is anyone here? Is anyone here? Uh, I'm here to help. I've heard you calling to. Duh! Mm, he? Uh, uh. Good lord. Uh, uh, oh my gosh, I hear you in my head. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. This is like Sun and Moon, but he, he's not part of me. Uh, uh, hello, uh, I've come to help you. If you wish to help me, then you must wish to help all others before me. Time runs short. If you wish to help me, you must become a creator in what you are. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 what do you mean becoming greater than what I am? I, I'm, I'm not sure I understand. Your system, your fucking perfect anomaly, a designation sun and moon. But if you allow my system to be real, you will help me. <coughs> you have more well, uh, uh, absolutely uh, than this mother's monster grows restless. Allow me to control my anger. This will not hurt Sun or Moon, will it? No, this will not harm Sun or Moon. It will even protect them and you. Wait, really? Uh, it'll protect us? As my anchors are deactivated, I will strike my protective influence. But allowing me to implant one more into you could be a different story from the monster. There's its head. I, I, I don't understand. There's no the child comes to find the throne, it would rise to see Shepard down in its stead. It would think the guys that go to the world, and the father is in the sleep of Paul, and the city shall be snuffed out. You keep mentioning this monster. Is it here? Here at the pizza place? Time grows short. Designate the fate at F to lost the near. Wait! Who? Call upon them for help. Then you may find the child. Nature sick. Uh. Huh? Mesus? Well, what happened? Only two nodes remain. The remaining anchor in my primary. I will soon be made obsolete. But I will keep trying to complete my task. But you're it's growing unstable here. You must leave, Eclipse. But I. I'll do it! Please! We set out to help everyone that we can, and that includes you, Mixus. I won't leave you behind. We're not abandoning you. Thank you. Your system will now update itself to make itself whole with my pieces. You will receive me. Make a new anchor within yourself. That will house my better. Uh, I... I promise. I'll take good care of it. Eclipse! Eclipse! Eclipse, please! Eclipse, can you hear us? Uh, yes, 
Yes, I, uh, uh I'm alright. Eclipse, your system is overloading. Uh, I'm fine, I, I promise. Eclipse? What happened? <sighs> oh my gosh, I'm feeling too full. T tired of. I'm going to pass out. I'm alright, I promise. Just tired like before. <laughs> I found him though. I was able to find him. And we're going to help him. We, uh, just need to hurry and find. <clears throat> Eclipse, wait! You need to rest first! Eclipse! 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 Ah. Yes. I got him! Oh, are you alright? Yes, of course. Is he? He's. He's online. He. He's. updating? Updating? My system is ours. I, I know, but. Maybe it's something to do with his personal data? I. I just hope he'll be okay. Yeah, but. He, he will. He'll be right as rain in no time. Well, you can go ahead and take good care of Eclipse. We need to start looking around here. Of course. Someone's coming! What? Sounds like Freddy's footsteps. Freddy? Is that you? <laughs> Not, <laughs> Not Freddy! Freddy! <laughs> <laughs> Your signature says Beta F. That's a prototype! <laughs> Monty? Sugar Snap? Are you feeling any better? Yeah. Yeah, I am. I'm just glad that Bonnie really is back with us. He's going to be okay once this is all over, right? My crow! You didn't tell me there was more of you little buggies! You can't talk! Also, what do you mean more but Hey, what the f***? Monty, they're so cute! Oh, we need to make a little nest for them. Oh, and I bet we can make them a little palace of dollhouses. Okay, but why? You guys are going to have the Ultra Mega Super Penthouse that we even make Bobby P. Green with envy. You're really going all out on this, huh? Well, duh. We haven't been able to play with those toys in who knows how long. So we're going to put them to use. We? <laughs> Fine, only if I get to be Godzilla. And then you want to grab those legs, cause you're only halfway there. <laughs> oh, dang, alright. I see how it is, Chica. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I couldn't help it. Aren't these just the cutest little nibbles you've ever seen? Heck yeah, cuter than I thought. Alright, let's get you into the pet house, little one. You having fun over there, Monty? Heck yeah! I even found a little bug that's like me. So, uh, he's officially Monty Jr. Uh, Jr. Hmm. Don't talk to me or my spider son ever again. Yeah! Oh my god, Monty! Let him out of your mouth! Hell no! Nah. He's safe with his grumpy gator, right, buddy? Yeah! Oh, Jimmy! Moon! We need to calm it down somehow! Any plans? Yeah! Get some place higher! I have an idea! Yeah! Right there, Moon! Got him! Alright! Over here! We're over here! Moon, are you ready? No, I am. That's it. Calm down. <sighs> I'm so glad that wire trick still works. I didn't want to have to deactivate them. You ready to calm down? Good. There you go. It's probably really scared and confused. We can try to help it understand what's going on. If this is a prototype, where's the real Freddy? I wonder if that strange child with no guest profile had something to do with this. I... I uh, I'm not entirely sure. But we need to focus on trying to communicate with the prototype Freddy for now, until we can find more answers. Mm, you're right. Most of his sensory receptors are housed in the torso for the beta models. If it's not too terribly damaged, he may still hear us. It's just... probably... muffled. So just try to be patient and slow for him. Alright, here goes nothing. I mean, honestly, son, you might be better fitted for this. Oh, would that make you more comfortable, Moon? Yes, please. <laughs> All right. Then you can take care of Eclipse until I'm done. Then we'll all make our way back to the daycare. <sighs> all right. 
Let's get started. Freddy, can you hear me? Proto, if you can still hear me, I want you to raise up your left hand. Mm. There you go. Good boy. You're doing very well. It's all right, Proto. Mm. We're not going to leave you. We're here. We're here. It's all right, Proto. I'll try to explain what's going on as simply but as in-depth as I can for you. Everything will be all right. And once we're done, I can help reduce some of that pain of yours, too. Even if you're not our Freddy, we know, everyone will still be so happy to see you. Now, let's get started. You are currently at Phaser Blast. Everything has been thrown into disrepair from a multitude of accidents. You are missing your head module. This is why half of your sensory is completely muffled. You have taken a fair bit of damage from collapsed material. But luckily, most of your internals are mostly undamaged. I'm Sun. The other you've met is Moon. Eclipse, I don't know if you can hear us, but I just hope you're okay. We're still here for you. When we get back to the daycare, I'll help remove as much of your pain sensory as possible. It won't be perfect, but I'll do my best. Then, once we introduce you to everyone, we're going to need your help. We have one more friend who is stuck, and we're going to need that wonderful strength of yours to help free him. I just want you to know you're okay. And whatever this update is, we just want you to be okay. Can still hear. Nah. Eclipse? Eclipse? He's still updating. Damn it. How long is this thing going to take? Moon? I think we're ready to head back to the daycare. Proto has been caught up as best as I could explain. But I've worked up a way to help orient him as we move back to the daycare. Just tap him twice in the direction he wanted to turn and... Oh. Moon. I'm fine. I'm just... Moon. It's alright. It's perfectly all right. You are allowed to be frustrated and worried. I am. I'm so worried. I just want Eclipse to be okay. I know. I do too. But he'll be back with us before we know it. Whatever he may be undergoing, he's strong. And I know he'll make it through in no time. Then, we'll be back together. Happy and safe. I hear you both. I feel you both. I promise you I'm not too far away. I'm still here with you. I love you both. Alrighty, we're ready to go. Mm. Alright, let's start heading this way, big guy. <clears throat> I think I know a way we can get you back with at least some ease. With Bruno with us now, we should have enough strength to free DJ. Then we can all band together and find Roxanne and Cassie! Gosh, I hope that little girl found her way out. Or at the very least is somewhere safe. I hope so too, son. I hope so too. M.A.W. King of the Foamy Kingdom! Chica, oh my god. What? Look at him! <laughs> he looks lost as hell is what he does. He's not lost! He's clearly thinking about how to protect his kingdom. From what breaks hell, oh divine chicken of the lake? Uh, I don't know. I didn't think it'd get this far. <laughs> huh? Um, from the evil giant. Uh-huh. Twig monster? Evil giant twig monster. Really? That was the best you got, chicken? N no, shut up! <laughs> you're fine, you're fine. I'm just messing with you, chicks. Yeah, that's it. Right this way. Hey, looks like the Cosmic Dream Team is back. Oh, good. Money! Hey, oh, jeez. You guys are already, uh, uh, okay. So, um, don't panic. So... This isn't what it looks like, okay? Moon, oh my gosh, that's a terrible way to start! Uh huh? <clears throat> um, he's kind of he's missing a head. Right. Not that. Ah! My man's missing his whole ass head! Are you absolutely positive that's not pretty? How can you be so sure? Monty, huh? he just said that his sticker signature says that he's a prototype. And Fred.
already beforehand had his! Great recovery time, Monty. Well, Freddy or not, I'm just sorry that it has to be in that state. I can't imagine how scary it must be to be in their shoes right now. Does Sonny know if he can help them with anything? I'm planning on dulling their physical receptors in order to nullify most of the pain, but hopefully still allow them to feel when we're trying to indicate directions for them. Nah, he's got a plan in mind. Oh, good. <clears throat> I know, I know. It's probably a bit uncomfortable me being inside you. But I need you to be online for this, so I can determine how much sensory I can dull without it making you completely sensoryless. It won't take too much longer. I promise. I'm almost done. Then we can go help DJ! And... and... Yeah, everything's coming together quite nicely. It is! Oh, once we find everyone, we can either stay here at the daycare or try to migrate everyone near the main entrance of the Plex and... And then we wait. And then we... We wait. I... I... I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that. N no, it's alright. It is... true. Oh, but you know what? It could take a million years before Fazra Entertainment comes looking for us. But that would be fine, because we'd all be back together. All of us! Who cares how long we wait? We will be able to have each other day in and day out. We'll try new things, break new rules, together. All under the watchful rays of sunlight and moonlight pouring in through the windows. And for that, I'd happily wait. <laughs> you always did have a way with words, son. Son, have you finished with Proto over there? I just finished, actually. Oh, good. I, uh, I can't tell since, well, you know. Yeah, but luckily now he won't be in so much pain. Yeah, that's good. Still, kind of off-putting to see him completely headless. <gasps> oh, wait! I have an idea! A another one? Huh? No. Yes! Just this last thing, and we can go get DJ! Mm. Perfect! Oh, my... <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Hey, look! Freddy's back! Where did he come from? Moon, <laughs> oh, please! Ah. Uh. Sun, Moon, is that you? Yes, DJ, we're back. I hear the others, too. DJ, we're coming! We're coming, big man! Oh, thank heavens! DJ, hey, DJ we're, we're, here. we're here for you! We're here for you! Okay! Oh, my heavens! Oh, what a sight for sore eyes. Goodness, I'm so sorry to see you all in such a state. But good heavens, am I absolutely enthralled to see you all. Where's Roxanne? We've yet to find her, but when we get you free, all of us can look for her. Ah, yes, of course. Come on, guys, I have a plan. Let's get some of this off the top first, then we can start knocking the rest of this off. Got it. Come on, Proto. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to get some of the rubble out from under DJ, so we may be able to slowly regain more mobility, too. My goodness, Monty. <laughs> you plan on going under me, huh? And we haven't even had dinner yet, cute stuff. <laughs> oh. I'm sure I'll figure something out. I'll take you to Olive Garden later. How's that sound, big guy? Here, give me your hand. Thank you, Pumpkin. Proto, toss that over there, okay? We can move that one next. Alright. Mmm. Goodness has it truly been so long since we all last had some quality time together. That truly is quite a... <laughs> My, um, that is a sensation. Ha! <laughs> That's a new sound I've never heard from you. <laughs> Hush. Stop that, okay, Gator Boy? Uh, mind your head down there, DJ! Uh, you alright? Yes, I'm fine. Keep it going. I can feel some of the weight lifting already. Y'all are doing splendid. Come on! Huh? It's coming loose! Go, Moon, go! I can... I can move my legs! Uh. Well done, well done, all of you! DJ, how are you feeling? Hmm. <laughs> oh, my entire body is a bit shaky after not being able to move for so long, but I assure you, I am absolutely fantastic! You look fantastic, Sugar Pie! Hell yes! Stretch out them old spider bones! Oh! Oh, you did amazing! Oh, you did fantastic! I'm so very... Son, 
I <laughs> if you hug me any tighter, you're gonna pop my ear pixels, okay, bud? Don't care! What is it? <laughs> Son, please. Oh, but this is great! Now we can try to have everyone help look for Roxanne and Cassie! Then we can all be together again! And Cliff should be waking up soon, too. Oh, I can't stand it! <laughs> Son, let DJ rest for a moment, please. I am! I am! Don't worry! <laughs> What's so funny? Are you telling me not to worry? Or are you telling yourself, son? Hey! Percy, what are you doing? Eclipse! Oh, Eclipse! You're okay! How are you feeling? Cassie's! Sin Roxy's! Raceway! She's in danger! You have to hurry! Huh? What? Eclipse! You saw Cassie? No, no, but she's being lured down to a horrible trap. She'll be killed! She'll be killed? By what? Well then, now is no time for rest, it seems. Roxy Raceway should be diagonal of the Fazcade. And I'll be sure to get us there! Minx's roaming anchor was reset. He says that is the second to last one before he gets terminated for good. Uh, but Lucky... Wait! Who? Oh! The friend I went... What the hell is a roaming anchor, Eclipse? <laughs> uh, uh, I got you, jeez. Uh, 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 there. That should do the trick. Here, I'll take over from here. Okay, my turn to get kicked out, I guess. Wait, Eclipse! DJ's not even done breaking through! It's fine. We just need to be ready once DJ breaks through the next- You! Oh my! Um, you were the little cutie that I've seen before! You're not Sun, nor are you Moon. Who are you, sweetheart? I, 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 I'm Eclipse. Eclipse? What a sweet name! I'm sure you've been quite busy with those two silly boys. Them. Hey! <laughs> I'm I'm just glad they are all right after everything that's happened. I just want to be sure everyone will be okay. Everyone will be thanks to all of you. You have done so great so far. Tom sure will find Cassie. Don't you worry. <laughs> Thank you, Chica. We appreciate that. When this is all over, I'm going to hug you for an entire month. Make that a year, and I'll be down for it. Oh my gosh! Please, you two. <laughs> All right, let's find our dear little guest, okay, guys? All right, let's get going. Cassie? Oh, Cassie? Cupcake, we're here to help you, hon. Don't worry, Cassie. We'll find you. I promise. Cassie? Cassie? You can't be in here. It's dangerous, sweetheart. Cassie? 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 Maybe we can get a higher vantage point. That could work. Our tether is not fully available due to the damage on the ceiling. But a quick lift should let us see everything eclipse. Mm, all right. sweet little honey drop. Won't you come down? I'm sure we'll find them soon enough. <sighs> okay. There, there now. Don't lose hope now, my dear Amber Adoration. I'm sure something will turn up soon. Oh. Huh? Oh. Down there! Now, make haste, uh, my buttercup. You will be much faster than us. Roxanne and Hal sounds desperate. We'll find our way soon after you. Uh, thank you. I'll see you guys down there soon. Let's go, Moon. You got it. Good luck. All right, boys. Let's see if we can make our way down there without too much extra damage. Ah, speak for yourself. I don't mind getting a bit banged up, especially if we can help our little guests. You go on ahead. I'll see if there's an alternative way for me to get down there. Access tunnel, maybe? I don't know. Just get going. Oh, we're getting closer. Good, good. Maybe we're not too late. I can't believe this type of structure was underneath the pizza plex the whole time. <gasps> Who's there? <sighs> Roxanne! Oh god, Cassie, she's... Don't worry, Eclipse! I have emergency medical training! I'll be able to help her! Roxanne... Huh? The monster! Monster? Huh? Moon, keep away from that thing! It's stronger than you think! <sighs> we need to get Cassie out of here so I can tend to her injuries! We won't be able to get Cassie out of here safely if we don't take care of that thing first! 
Say no more then. I'll tear that thing's wiring. <laughs> Wait, Moon, don't! You are nothing. <laughs> It'll use the guise of those we know. That includes ourselves. But we must not let it get the better of us. Roxanne, <laughs> wait! Don't you dare use my voice! Get away from her, you bastard! <laughs> I... Uh, I'm alright. In my head. Easy, Moon. Here, let me help. <laughs> Roxanne! Hear my beacon over here! Wait, our pain is gone. <sighs> there you are. <sighs> I'm putting you in timeout! Son, let me out, I can help. Not if you're going to be siphoning all of our pain, Eclipse. Wait, Eclipse, you're doing what? Son! Son! Let go of him! You think you're better than me? Roxy! Proto! Sunny! Chica! Oh, you guys are okay. I hope we didn't take too long. No! Perfect timing as always! Chica. Oh, I'm so glad you're all okay. We are! We just need to get rid of that thing! Chica! Chica! Come on! Let's get back there and help Proto! Right! Let's get him! Let's go! Alright, got you back! Oh no! Proto? Moon, please, let me out! I will, just not yet! You keep that beacon on that thing! I can do that, but you better promise me. Of course I do. Moon? We trust him, son. Yes, yes, of course. He can do it. Light beam coming through. Out of my way. Huh? Uh, huh? Let's go, little guy. Let's rock. Um, isn't that body he's throwing? <laughs> now make some room. I'm gonna tear this thing apart. Hey, Proto, get in on this! Help us rip this thing in half! Hey, don't start the party without me! Chica, wait! Oh, uh-huh. We have a very important job for you. We need you to grab Cassie. You can get her out of here and back to safety. And we can keep this thing from getting out. Oh, you got it, boys. I'll keep her safe. All right, let's get ready to move in. Moon, please be careful. We don't want to endanger Cassie, nor risk the monster escaping. We'll do everything we can to hold it back so Chica and Cassie can safely escape. Then we can try to cut off all routes of escape for it, leaving it trapped down here forever. Perfect. If we can do that, then we can make sure no one ever falls victim to it again. Come here, sweetheart. Mind your head. Let's get you some mercy. <sighs> How the hell do you open this thing? I don't care! Just tear off whatever you can! Monty! Chica! Wait! Chica! Give me Cassie. I can run faster. And I'll be able to get her to the medical bay. Roxy? Don't you trust me, Chica? Yes, of course I trust you, Roxy! I... I... You keep away from them! <gasps> Eclipse? Get out of here! Hurry, Chica! Ha! <sighs> We're not going to let you hurt anyone anymore! <sighs> you are a fool. You are simply an anomaly. <laughs> Nothing you do will stop me. And when I tear apart all those who oppose me, it will be you who is left behind to rot. And when I render you broken and obsolete, you will lay lifeless and broken in the ashes of rotten and deranged memories. <laughs> <laughs>
while I in agonized wrath will rend this world apart. Uh huh? But that's where you're mistaken. I'm not just an anomaly. Not anymore. And I'm certainly not alone. All of us are here and together. We are strong. You do not decide our fates. We will. And this is not the day we choose to die. That's right. Saliva. Well, the sooner we can get you some emergency attention, the better. You're a bit dehydrated too, but I'd rather Sun handle that, since he still has both hands. Come on, Sugar Plum. And we'll also make sure that no one else can come back up. Here, sweetheart. You stay right here. Mama Birdie's gonna freak some stuff up real quick. All right. <sighs> Let's make sure this monster doesn't have a way back up and stay stuck down here forever! Alright, boys. I know you said you'd figure a way back up just to be safe. <laughs> I do hope I didn't take too terribly long. DJ! <laughs> Perfect timing as always, DJ. <clears throat> so, this is our little troublemaker, hmm? Yes, they are exceptionally dangerous. They're a lot sturdier than they look, too. Can we even incapacitate them? Well, now, why don't we see? <laughs> Crumbling here. We need to leave before we get buried down here. Uh, DJ, you hit the ceiling too hard, bud. Uh, forgive me. I'm in a uh, very precarious position, pinning it. Uh, was my only option. Someone, please come and help grab it before. It... Uh, Come to me, I'll get us out! <clears throat> Come on, everyone. <clears throat> Here you go, my dear friends. DJ, thank you so much. Oh, but of course, my sweet speed star. I do hope both of you are quite alright. Yeah, everyone's okay. Oh, especially thanks to you. Oh, aren't you sweet? I didn't even help much. It's now that's a freaking it's lie! It's gone. Eclipse? What about your friend? Are they alright? Hey, yeah! We never saw them, but we could feel someone else there with us. I... I don't know. He's the one who told me how dangerous that thing was, and the one who helped us find Cassie. And now it's my fault that thing is... I'm gonna stop you right there. Eclipse, it's not your fault. It's no one's fault. It probably hasn't even been able to leave yet since this place is so ruined. I hope you're right. Mixis, uh, are you okay? I have failed in my appointed task, and I have therefore failed you, Eclipse. Huh? I am sorry. No! Huh? Well, what is he? You haven't failed. I have. Please, don't punish yourself for my mistake. I should be the one apologizing to you, Mixis. But I promise you, I'll do everything I can to find the monster. But it isn't your fault. I promise you that. For now, though, you should rest. 
You helped us so much protecting everyone from the Mimic's lies and deceit. Son, can you see who he's talking to? No, I can't. But clearly someone is there. Son, I'll let you take back over so you can go tend to Cassie. Uh, oh, uh, sure. As you wish. Huh? Um... Here, son. Go ahead and take care of Cassie. I have some thoughts to think on. Oh! Uh... Okay! What? Alright, sweetheart. I'll let you rest right next to Bonnie. He can keep you some company while we wait for the boys to get back. There we go. I'll grab the first aid kit and clean up some of those bumps and scrapes. And maybe one of the boys can flag someone down to take you to get personal care? And call your family? Maybe Roxy remembers your family emergency contacts. You were her special rock star after all. But as soon as everyone gets back, everything will be okay. Everything will be okay. Oh, hello again, little one. Were you worried about us? <laughs> Don't worry, we're back now. Everyone should be coming back real soon. Chica! Cassie! We're here! We're here! Oh, Sunny, thank goodness you're here! I got the first aid kit and cleaned up Cassie's minor injuries. Oh, good! I'll take over from here and see if I can offer anything a bit more major while we try to get someone's attention from outside. T to be honest, though, everyone's a bit nervous to go out and try to flag someone down since, you know, it's against our programming. And Fazbear Entertainment could just scrap whomever was found outside to avoid bad rap. But we are all in agreement that it's for Cassie's health and safety. So we are willing to take that risk. Oh uh, yeah, if you'd like, I could go out to try and flag someone. Monty might be too scary looking. Roxanne might get hurt since she can't see anymore. Same with Proto. Well, first things first. Let me tend to Cassie and try to rehydrate her. Then we'll move her and Bonnie to the entry lobby. Then we'll move other things as needed. <laughs> hey there, Bonnie! Did you hold down the fort while we were down below? Thank you! And you'll be able to come with us while we take your body to the main lobby, too! <laughs> yeah, yeah! Are we just gonna drive on past that? Bonnie said, huh? What? What? Huh? Okay! Alright. Let's get over this sunken area and start prepping Harry for a little guest to rest. Yeah, there's too much rubble. Then once Sun and Moon and the new kid get back, we'll draw straws or something on who's going out. I should. Cassie's family used to work here, so if I can get someone's attention, they'll know she's safe with me. Now, now, we'll all need to talk this over, okay? <clears throat> wow. Looks like DJ's making a clearing for Cassie to lay down in while we try to get someone's attention. We should go grab more foamies and blankets for her and Bonnie. Yeah, that sounds good. It shouldn't take too long, and DJ can hold her in the meantime since his palms are plush. Perfect. All right, I'll get Monty to help me place Bonnie down. All right. <sighs> okay. We've brought plenty of foamies and blankets! Okay, but what if we get more, though? <laughs> Moon, please. Bonnie! What do you mean you've been in there this whole time? I threw one of you at the Crean! I wouldn't have done that if I knew you were in these little sons of guns! Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh, this reminds me of setting up for nap time! Oh, I'm going to miss this! I... I mean, you never know, we might get to again one day. Who knows? I know we will. And when that day comes, I'll look forward to seeing both of you so happy. Alright, there's plenty of cushioning. And we can pop her head up and keep her comfortable. It looks fantastic, my sweet little star. Okay, I'll go ahead and take Cassie now. The bedding is ready, and since dawn is barely rising, I want to make sure they're comfortable. Of course, my little comment. Huh? <laughs> what? Tarnation? Huh? Hey! They're there! We found you! Good job, Freddy. 